This is 3x minus 2y is equal to 13. And then we have 2x plus 3y is equal to 0. So the first thing will be to cancel what is here and here. So we need to cancel the y values. So how do we cancel the y values? We do this. We get whichever number is here and write it down. When whichever number is right here, write it uh, straight with the, the first equation, okay? So, now, are you supposed to put anything here? It depends. You can either put negative here or here. Now, let's, let's check. What is it that determine you to put a negative here or here? If the signs are different here, don't put anything. Just get uh, the constants and put them here. Switch. You switch them. If the signs are the same, if we are negative, negative, we would have uh, put one of these a negative. If it is a uh, positive, positive, we would have changed. So remember this key, um, key point. When the signs are the same here, put one of these a negative. Or if they are, yeah, when they are same, either be, be it positive or negatives here, Remember to put a negative sign here. If the signs are different, in this case, we have got negative and positive. Just leave them the way they are. And then you multiply, we've got a 9, okay? Because if we say 3 times 3, it's 9, and the x there. Here we have a 6y. Here we have a 39. Because 13 times 3 is 39, okay? Here we have a 4x. 2 times uh, 2x is 4x plus 2 times 3y is 6y, which is equal to a 0. 2 times z, uh, 0 is uh, just a 0. Now we put a line and then we say plus. We start adding them. So 9x plus 4x, that will give us, uh, it will give us uh, 13x. Here, what are we going to get? Negative y plus negative negative six y plus negative uh, plus uh, plus six y. It's a it's just a zero. So these will cancel, and this is where the name comes from for elimination because we cancel here. Here we say thirty nine plus zero. It's a thirty nine. So we can divide by thirteen. Divide by thirteen. So our x will be equal to when we cancel here. We remain with this x. 13 into 13, it's 1 into 39 is equals to 3. So our x value is equal to uh, 3. Okay. So now we have found the x value. We can find or we have to find the y value. So for the y value, we get any of the equations. Any of the equations. So if you want, you can get this one or this one. So I'll get the bottom one. Okay. Okay, so this is what we have. Actually, this is 3y. So now, we have found the value of x to be equal to what? To x. I mean to 3. The value of x to be equal to 3. So we say 2. Where there is x, we put a 3 plus 3y, which is equal to 0. When we multiply here, we are getting a, a 6 plus 3y is equal to 0. We group the like terms. We have 0 minus 6. This is positive. It comes this side. It will be minus. So we have uh, something like this. We divide by 3. Divide by 3. Y will be equal to negative uh, 2. Because 3 into 3, 1 into negative 6 is uh, 2. Negative 2. So our answer is equal to negative 2.